Welcome to a BMC video. Today I'm going to show you how to create a virtual table on Smart Reporting. You need to follow these steps to create a virtual table on Smart Reporting. First, you'll need to get the base query of the virtual table. You can use another report as the SQL query is not a normal one as we were used to have. This is an example of a query that we can insert and use a virtual table. We need to modify this query a little because uh, normally like this, it, it, it won't work on smart reporting. Then you just need to add the virtual table and evaluate the, the code and test the virtual table. On the view builder, you need to drag and drop virtual table. Then you need to click on SQL, paste the query that, that you have and validate the, the SQL. On the first instance, this seems to be correct, but you will be only be able to fetch the first line of data. Need to enable all the fields and test. As you can see, First name is displayed in here, even if we're selecting a status. And if we try to select first name, we will get an error on this query. To fix this, we'll need to get back to the view and modify the SQL query. Now we just need to assign alias to each of the fields. For example, in this one, we can say first name. This one we can say as incident status. This one we can say, in this one we can say incident count. and validate the query. Again, we'll need to add the columns as we change the name with alias, and we can proceed to test again. Now all your values will show correctly. You can return to view and publish this view. This concludes the, the video. Thank you and see you in the next one.